Thermal Mechanical Analyzer, or TMA, is a very common thermal analysis tool for measuring the thermal expansion or shrinking of a sample as it's being heated or cooled. Today, I'm going to show you how to load a sample, a solid sample, for the measurement of CTE. A common sample would be something like a cubic or a thin film. This is a thin layer of plastic. You can measure the thermal expansion on the x or y direction or the z direction. Uh, I will first show you how to run the z direction CTE. To measure the z direction, um, you have to have a sample uh, laying on its side. And if the sample is too thin, we, you can stack a couple layers up um, according to your ASTM method. So the first thing you want to do is to lower the probe and tear the probe position. You click the auto zero button to measure the original position. And when it's stabilized, you want to lift the probe and put the sample on the platform right under the probe. Then you can lower the probe and the sample thickness will be recorded. Once the sample is placed in the platform, you can raise the furnace and set up the temperature program starting temperature, ending temperature, scan rate, then you can start a run. When you want to measure the CT on the XY direction, you have to turn the sample up like this. Uh, then you will need a fixation clip, something like this, to hold the sample upright. This kind of fixture clips are commonly used for SEM or FTIR uh, samples to hold the sample up so you can look at the cross section. But now we can use it also for the TMA sample measurement. So you clip, put a sample in between the clip, and after tearing the probe position, and you lift the probe, then you can place the sample under the probe like that. Then you can lower the probe, apply a force, and raise the furnace. Then you can measure the CT on the X or Y direction of a solid sample.